I will show you uh, example that uh, you don't have to look x. Okay, you don't have to look x. Okay, because I already explained. Sometimes there are cases that uh, you don't have to look one with x. Okay, just enough uh, looping one value only. Right, so you look at the first example. Okay, this is the first example. So you have two value of one and two value of x. So the objective of KMAP is actually you need to look only one value. Okay, value one. Okay. So if uh, you have x and then x, uh, we need to look for the bigger size so you can take x. But in this case, in this first example, you already have one okay, that adjacent with each other. Okay, so that's why we don't need x okay, for our looping. Okay, so the answer here is actually only one loop. Okay, we one loop. So by looping all value of ones in this loop, so we just complete uh, looping the value of uh, one in this keyman. So what about this x? So you just ignore. Okay, you just ignore. Okay? And then for the second example, also uh, actually as the uh, quite similar with the first example. So you have four value of one and then two value of x. So in this case, you only loop value of one, okay, without including the x. Okay, that's it. Uh, you don't need to take x. You just ignore the x. Sometimes students, they tend to loop x. Okay, they tend to loop also x. Okay, uh, they just uh, looping value of one. And then because they also have x outside of the loop, so you loop x. Okay, this is wrong. Okay, x when the outside of the loop is actually the value for x is actually zero. So that's why we don't have to loop x. We only take x when we want to produce a bigger size of loop. In this case, you don't need to have a bigger size because your one, your uh, all value ones is already in the loop. There are no balance of one, right? just x so just ignore the x same goes with the first example there are no balance of one that not included in the loop only x so you just ignore the x all right so for example three okay you have two x and then two one so how you can look this value if you have one that can be looked together so you can ignore ignore the x for this case you have two cell which is this cell a bar b bar and c and then this cell a b bar and c okay so this two cell is actually adjacent and then these two cell have value of one so you can look together this cell with this cell okay so it will be like this Okay, by looping like this, all value of 1 is actually included in the loops. Okay, so you just ignore the x. Okay, so if you do like this, so this is actually uh, wrong. Okay, I show you wrong uh, method. So if you do like this, you loop 1 with x and then another uh, 1 also with x. So if you compare this example with this example, of course these two examples show, show you, you that all one is actually in the loop. But what about the number of loops? If you refer to third example, you only has one loop. The one loop that include all ones. Okay, bit one. Okay, in one loop. But for fourth uh, number four example. You have two loops. Okay, two loops. So there are more loops compared with the third example. That's why this kind of uh, looping is totally wrong. You cannot do this kind of looping. So you don't have to take x. Yeah, you just ignore the x. Okay, 
because by ignore the x you still can look uh, the value of one okay. so the tips for this kind of uh, looping when your k map have the value of x is actually you you need to construct the value of one first you need to look at the value of one where is the location or where is the cells for value of one if all ones can be looked together without taking the x so you just look one but if you need x to form a bigger size so you can take x in the loop so this is a uh, examples how you can loop your key map without taking x inside your loop okay so i hope you can understand the process of looping that include the don't care term you can uh, do the exercise in your book there are some uh, key maps okay, that you can loop okay, that have the don't care term so please try looping all the key maps in your exercise uh, book okay in your book okay if there are any questions you can ask me so that's all. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.